Right now at 6, the system is up, but many essential workers still can't apply for premium pay. This is a new state program to give bonuses to those who had work during the pandemic and those in the private sector. But the website crashed and is causing lots of frustration. Chief political reporter Susan Raff is on the answer desk with answers to some of those issues for us. Susan. Stephanie, the site went up last week, and since then, Channel 3 has been flooded with emails. Many of you are having problems uploading documents and even just logging onto the website. We wanted to get some more answers. So this is the website. Yep, and um, so you just apply for payment and begin the application now. Kim Chaya is a healthcare worker. After several tries, she was able to create an account, even though the site froze a few times. But she's now unable to upload any documents. I did finally get to the point where I could actually had an account. Um, it sent me a link and then I had to set it up and it allowed me to do that. But I have not been able to, I've been able to sign in, but I just can't get past that point. And today she wasn't able to get on at all. The screen said our services aren't available right now. Kim and thousands of others are eligible for premium pay. The bonuses are for private sector essential workers like health care workers, bus drivers, child care providers, and those who worked in grocery stores during the pandemic. We heard from Lori, who says when she tries to upload documents, they don't attach. The response from the Connecticut Office of the State Comptroller, the program is not first come, first serve, and that eligible workers have until October 1st. Daniel Golden is also having trouble uploading files and says he can't get anyone to answer phone calls or emails. The response, anyone who is registered can log in at any time, and if people leave a voicemail, they will get a call back. Brian Ada is another healthcare worker who is having trouble. Every time I tried it, it would just go to an error page. Well, now that you hear that you're not alone and there are so many people, it's kind of annoying, isn't it? It is a bit annoying. Um, yeah, I guess I figure I'll keep trying. If you think you're eligible and you still have questions, you can watch CT22 this Sunday at 8.30. The state comptroller will be on to talk about this program and hopefully help you apply. Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Yeah, people still looking for help, Susan. Thank you very much.